Hello everyone, this is your girl Juliana, aka Life is Juliana and welcome back to my channel. So today your girl, yeah, is bringing you another tablescape idea, cheap, affordable and on an extreme friendly budget. However, I'm going to put this particular tablescape in a mixture. I'm going to turn things around, switch things up, I'm going to let it flow and I'm just going to have fun with it as I go. All right. So if you're here watching me doing this tablescape for your very first time and you have not already subscribed, feel free to do so and then turn on your post notification settings to be reminded every time I upload a brand new video. Now, without going any further, let's jump right into this video show. Okay, y'all so I decided to start off with this vase right here and I did buy this vase in Goodwill and I paid about two dollars and twenty nine cents for it and I did add these flowers that I found in where did I find these flowers in Walmart um, and so I decided to just put the the glass underneath and I did purchase that um, from the Dollar Tree and this is how it looked with this particular centerpiece. I did like it a lot, but I wasn't really feeling it. It looked alright and everything, but I wasn't really feeling it that much. It had a more kind of a um, an even time type of setup, but it still looked nice. But let me tell you guys, these plates you're probably going to see them in a lot of tablescapes because I love them so much. I found them in um, Good 
goodwill, y'all. Goodwill. Let me tell you, these these plates here are the bomb. I love it. So you're definitely gonna see me using these plates a lot. And then um, the charger and stuff that was from Hobby Lobby's and the table map that was from Ross. The forks and stuff that is from uh, the Dollar Tree. Now, I decided to go ahead and move that base and try something different. We're just going to go ahead and just play around with this tablescape and have fun with it. So I decided to put these on top of the glass just to see how it look. Just to, you know, play around and see how it look. And it was kind of cute. I was like, hmm, not bad at all, not bad at all. But it was still missing something. It was still missing something. So I decided to put the salt and pepper shaker on, on there. Mm, it was nice. That looked really, really nice. Very impressive. Very different, for sure. But, yeah. Mm, it was still kind of missing something. So I removed one of them. And then put the salt shaker on there. And it really did look, you know, pretty impressive. I did like that. It was cute. It was really cute. Those um, salt and pepper shake, I've had those for a minute. I bought those in a department store in Connecticut. So I've had these for a long, long time. And well, let me tell you guys about the, the, the table, the table of napkins. Those napkins, I found them in Goodwill, all right? They were four, I got, no, I got six for about four dollars, something like that. And then the the table, the rings, O to the M to the G, I bought those, um, I bought the bowls in the Dollar Tree and the bathroom rods in the Dollar Tree and just threw them together. And there you have it, I had me some beautiful table napkin ring, right? Now, let's still play around with the centerpiece. So this right here, I bought this in Goodwill and I paid a dollar and 29 cents for it. And I went ahead and put these flowers that I had bought in Walmart and just placed them in there like so. And then I wanted to go ahead and add some more colors to it. I did buy this right here in the Dollar Tree for sure. And I had two that I bought and my mother used them for Christmas. So you're definitely going to see me using these for Christmas, right? But that was from the Dollar Tree and then the others. This was from Walmart and I only paid a dollar for that. All these flowers right here is a dollar in Walmart. Yes, y'all. Mm -hmm. That looked really, really nice. Kind of fluff it up a little bit. It... I like this look. It really, all the colors were blended in with everything else that I have on the tablescape. But I have to confess, I did not like the height of this. Maybe if you stack it up on, on two books or something, just to give it a little bit more dimension, a little bit more height to it. The arrangements was pretty nice. And as you can see, it's all blended in. Everything is perfect. But I needed a little bit more height. So, yeah, it was all right. It was pretty good. I liked it, though. It was pretty good. So I tried to do our poops it up a little bit and just add the salt and pepper shaker to the side. Like so. And that looked really nice as well. Because we're definitely going to be playing around with this, y'all. We're going to be playing around with this because I love this table set up here. These plates are giving me life. I love these plates. So now what I decided to do was to change out the, the wine glass. And these wine glass, you probably see them in prior videos. I bought these in Goodwill for a penny on a, on a, on a nickel, okay? Really cheap. So they looked really, really nice, I have to say. Um, it looked nice, but the only thing that I didn't like was the height. Because, like I said, for to use this these glass with this centerpiece... I would have to have it hired so stack on like two books or something it would have been perfect but otherwise it really blended in really good and I loved it either way either way I still love it but 
still, you know, I was just still playing around with it and having me some fun with it and just having fun with it. It was very nice. I liked it this way too. Okay, so what I decided to do was go ahead and play around with my napkin and my napkin ring right there. Alright. So this um nap this particular um napkin I use it for a prior video. So what I decided to do was combine all four together and see how it looks. Alright, that's all I decided to do because I really love this arrangement. This tablescape was giving me so much ideas, so much ideas. So I'm gonna set my camera down and just combine them four together and let's and see how it looked and let me tell you I was feeling it you could either do it like this or you could either push the bottom ring a little bit further and give it more life and it looked really nice I was very surprised look at that now that is what you call a napkin dimension nice well, okay, my loves, we are all done here, and I do hope you enjoyed this uh, tablescape setup as much as I enjoyed doing it, playing around, and having fun with it. So, give it a thumbs up on your way out, and I guess I will be seeing you in the next video. Ciao!